If you would like to book a personal tarot reading with me, I offer same-day personal tarot card readings for $20. You receive your reading the same day of your purchase. Everything you need to know of details is in the description box below of this video of how to book with me. Thank you so much. Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel and thank you for being here and for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val 333 Tarot and with Spirit and we're just going to jump right in here and see... What does spirit want to tell you the most today in regards to your current situation of who you're dealing with? What are their true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you? All right, now keep in mind this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. I do offer same-day personal readings for $20, and um, I have a bonus tarot channel at Val444 Tarot and a vlog channel at Val Smib. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you, Taurus. Let's see what's going on here with who you're dealing with. All right, right away, they don't like the bad news. They don't want to relay some bad news to you. They don't want you knowing a news or message or anything here of information. Um, they're really irritated and, and not so motivated here right now, okay? They don't want to talk. Maybe they've blocked you. I don't know. Not feeling too happy or inspired. Uh, it's because they're dropping the burden about you and them. They're letting it go. They're being done. They don't want to deal with it anymore, whatever that may be. Okay. Um, either they don't want to work with you or share with you their ideas anymore, or they could still be trying to take ideas from you, pluck off of you, or breadcrumb you, string you along. Okay, either or here. And that has made them super guarded and hostile with you and towards you, but they know they've been in the wrong too, involving with you. So they don't really know what to do. They don't want to own up and take responsibility and accountability of what's happened. Their environment's getting very chaotic, but they don't want to set up boundaries either. And that's making them get desperate and still want to stay in something with you in a toxic way, um, even though they'd rather go do something else. And that's why things are stuck and stalled and stagnant and not, there's no progression at all now, unless they're purposely not wanting to progress with you. It looks like here that they know they use you for finances, for money, something here. They use you as a crutch, energetically, emotionally, physically, financially. And so they're not walking away from you quite yet. Even though it does make them feel like crap. Okay, well that's because for some of you they are in a marriage or relationship with you. Okay. Um, or they want to marry you. Or... They're bringing in a completely different marriage or relationship outside of the both of you for whatever reason. Unless this is someone that's in their own marriage or relationship outside of you and they're dealing with you or family. Either or here. Okay. They're trying to keep the peace, but they're starting to lose it and get stressed out and freak out and get aggressive and want to argue with you and fight with you. Because they're getting annoyed and pissed off. They understand more so their perspective than yours, but they're trying to still keep their cool with whatever this is about. Okay, looks like they still want to plan with you, make things work with you though. And they're aware of a lot and they're moving quick and maybe talking to you, communicating to you, messaging you, saying something here to you. And it looks like here it causes them to feel emotionally completely disconnected from you. Very upset and angry, moody. Okay. But they want an opportunity with you. Okay. It also could be that they're upset with you because they have feelings for you. But they can't be with you yet. But they want an opportunity here with you. All right. A new chapter of some sort. Okay. This is someone that they want to celebrate with you. They want to party with you. This could be a friend. Okay. A friend group. Um, they want something here of celebratory reunion here with you, or they feel this way with you and towards you. Okay. 
okay and that's making them feel like they're all like they're gonna get what they want out of you their wish fulfillment or they kind of feel like you are their wish fulfillment for them or they're starting to realize are you really it for them is this really it for them you and them like are they really getting what they want was this truly exactly what they wanted in life with you they don't really know anymore but they are aware of the truth or they're going to speak their truth to you okay and it looks like here they're just going to be by themselves spend some time on their own go to counseling guidance teachings of some sort to gain more wisdom to sort out these issues with you and them it looks like here though that they still rather be loving kind nice friendly to you or be emotionally committed to you and it looks like here either they want to move forward on their own journey away from you or with you in a healing way but whatever that is that's caused them to get aggressive and stalk you and spy on you lurk creep get information on you in a manipulative way unfortunately like get obsessive now that's caused them to not want to change or reflect their ways okay and just kind of stay stuck but it looks like it's because they really desire this with you they have goals hopes dreams here with you or towards you they want something here with you but they're getting what they want with you and that yeah I mean, this is part of their secret plan here with you. Maybe you guys are, you know, have a secret plan together. They are very comfortable with you. You know, it makes them feel, you know, like they know what they're doing. They know what's going on. They're pretty, like I said, cool, calm, collected about whatever's going on here with the both of you. Yeah, and they want to continue building, budgeting, saving, growing, you know, with you in some way, shape, or form with all this. Yeah, and really have this abundance. Share this wealth, this money, this abundance with you. Um unless you know like i said this is someone with their own business and relationship and love and marriage outside of you i don't know and you'll know but it looks like here it's pretty wealthy pretty abundant there's a lot of stuff going on here that they have with themselves and with you though that they want to share with you looks like here and they're working really hard towards building and creating that and that's what they're going to keep doing here whether it's a, a towards you or with themselves hmm yeah, and it looks like they're not really sure how they want to go about this. Do they like you? Do they have fun with you? Do they love you? Are they in love with you? Do they have a crush on you? Do they want to finally tell you how they feel? They don't really know. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right. Wait right there before you click off. First of all, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that this helped you. Don't forget that I offer same-day personal tarot readings for $20. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. And by the way, for more tarot readings, if you'd like, please check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. I have a bonus tarot channel for the general collective at Val444 Tarot. And if you want to check out my vlog channel where it's about our personal life, you'll see a lot of my husband there as well, at Val Smib. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you so much. Bye.